Runs and four ribbies, and after the game, our Meredith Morakovitz caught up with Judge and asked him about those two homers. No, you really, you really don't think about it. You know, you don't even feel a touch of bat. And you know, I was happy to get those first three runs and kind of give us a lead, allow our pitching staff to go in there and do their thing, and um, just happy to keep give ourselves a lead. When we got a lead, this team is dangerous. You're a guy that's always taken a tremendous amount of pride in his defense. Just how difficult was that play to make there in the fourth inning? Oh, it was tough. You know, that's that's always a doozy because you know you got a guy that hits it that's got you know top end speed in the league, and you know if I miss that, it could be a double, triple, or even inside the parker. So you got to take risks sometimes, and um, you know, luckily it paid off. You don't get to the plate for that first home run if Joey Gallo doesn't work the walk, and then his home run, the difference maker there in the seventh inning. Nice to see him get going a little bit here in the second half. Oh, big time, big time. Yeah, Joey's, um, you know, he's always works works the count, works a good at bat. He's got a great eye. You know, so him getting that walk and kind of getting us getting us going a little bit before DJ had the single, you know, that was big time. And then later in the game, you know, gets another tough pitcher. He, you know, hits a homer. Man, it just shows you what he's capable of. So, you know, like you said, you know, keep it rolling here in the second half. This win almost overshadowed a little bit by the fact that Michael King walked off the mound there in that eighth inning. He's been such an integral part of the bullpen. What would it mean? What type of blow would it be if you guys lost him for an extended period of time? Yeah, you know, besides, you know, what he does on the field, you know, King's one of the best teammates and one of the hardest workers in this clubhouse, you know. You know, the work he puts in day in and day out and to see something happen like this, it's, uh, you know, it's, it's tough to see, you know. So, you know, my thoughts and my prayers are, are with him and, you know, hopefully, you know, we hear some good news. Aaron, thank you. Thank you. Next.